looking for inspirational food products in his new show, Field Trip with Curtis Stone. And he's one of our favorites around here. Chef, I'm always a fan. What was going on there and what is this show? <laughs> we were in the north of Spain and the, the goat um, herder told us the best way to try the milk is warm. And we're yeah. like, for real? So anyway, we, uh, we we did, and it was pretty delicious. I'm not was gonna it lie. pretty delicious? So I brought you lots of Fresh. delicious goat's cheese. <laughs> okay. Oh, I love cheese. It was made with milk just like that. Okay. But what I'm going to start with is some clams. Okay. All right. So um, we've got like literally... Uh, oh, you put it in with the shells and the whole deal? Shell the whole lot, right? Wow. So then you add the sofrito. So we've got manila clams and little okay. neck clams. The sofrito is just a little garlic and a little onion. See, oh, add a lot of that. You see, as soon as it hits wow. our hot pan... Oh, you don't want to throw the whole thing in there? That? No, just, no a just a little bit. All right. You, you like a little bit extra, Mario? What are you I like all the Mario. I like all the good. I like your place, Gwen, by the way, with the steak. Oh, I like all the mod. This is great. Okay, so what you do is you add a little bit of liquid and then you're going to steam them open. So a little orange oh, juice. Oh, and they steam open on their own. A little clam juice. So we're doing Ooh. some Spanish dishes. Oh, is, this is, like, is this like a paella that you're making well, right it's, here? It's just a clam dish, and this is sort of, you know, very, very typical of that northern Spanish. Ah, and there they upstart. are. So here, we, I cheated, of course. You know us. Okay, no. how long do you Chefs. cook it, though, for those at home, though, Curtis? How uh, long it only takes take? about five or six minutes, so very, very quick. Wow, that's quick. So, and then I toast some bread, you know, so I've thrown some bread into to a little grill pan, right? So here okay. you go. This is for you, Kit, my love. Okay. That's for you, Mario. Thank you, sir. And then the bread here. If okay. You got to do the bread over. and the sauce. Oh, we got to do so the bread. Have a little bit of that, and yeah. then okay. I'll pour a little of the juice over the top. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get the That's juice the in there. Is. Yeah, get in there. That's okay. where the goal is. So right what here. we do at, at Maud, our restaurant in oh, Beverly Hills, get in there. Get in there. We go to all these beautiful spots. Oh, look at this. And then we develop the menu based on the travel that we did. So I take the team with me. We go. We get the inspiration from the place. So we were in Rioja. You saw us tasting the, the goat's milk. Mm, oh, good. How is it? But your Boy. show, Field Trip, ah. it's on PBS. How right. cool. So were you really taking us into local culture? Yeah, right. and, and basically Field Trip is based on the menu development at the restaurant in Beverly Hills. So it's, li it's, a, it's a real trip. You know, we go there with the team, both the wine nerds that work with us. Speaking of wine, keep wine nerds. Oh, oh, let's get in there. You can pour a little of that. Curtis, I love the concept, uh -huh. too, because not only are you learning about, obviously, all the, the cuisine and the food there, right. but the culture, the people. You can't, that's, so and that's cool. what it's all about. That's so cool. I mean, Thank you, you dear. Know, the, the whole idea is that you're... you're in wine and clams are the best. I like your paw there, Kit. I like that. She's heavy, heavy. Listen, I like listen it. Curtis. Good job. Good job. Now, why is this so, wine good with this? Why would you so pair So this is a Tempranillo Blanco. Nice white wine so with the seafood. You got dry go with white it. wine. Right. Yeah, you drink that. Oh, my I'm life. a share. Oh, yeah. okay. I've got to use a knife. So, so with you get so you get the clams, so and then I imagine you can put this over some pasta too. And absolutely. Some rice, right? So what, really what, what we do is we go and tr try this really traditional food. Now I'm showing you it as traditional as we, as we find it in Spain. Okay. But then we bring it back to the restaurant, and then we reinterpret it through like a ten course menu at the restaurant. So. Oh, is that um, like a charcuterie? I like that. It is. So this is a uh, jamón. Hamon Serrano or Hamon Iberico. Uh, so Hamon. we've got this beautiful and pan con tomate. So a little tomato that you rub. Oh, wow, um, that's over great. The, and then uh, we can go through, get go, on this go deal, ahead. right? I'm going to get in here. Um, help yourself. Make sure. Do a couple what is that things. machine, uh, Curtis? Something's going so, on so on the So this is here. like a uh, you have that um, Hamon. Right so yeah, we actually slice the Hamon fresh. Do I put a little right. cheese on top of this, Gwen? So, so this I mean, is uh, the, the, the cheese is right here. I've been called worse. I've been called worse. It's Gwen Stefani's birthday. Call me one of your life. Okay, wait, can I, I throw some the... cheese on the yes, ham? Yes, you can, of course And then can. I go a little nut? So it's three different nuts, the whole deal. Of, um, goat's cheese in the front. We think a goat's cheese is one thing, right, Chev? Yep. But actually, goat's cheese can be aged, it can be soft, it can be creamy. So I've got three different goat's cheeses here, and then I threw in a cow's milk um, and a uh, sheep's milk as well. You know, when you're putting together a, a cheese board, you right. might want to go for three different textures or three different... No milk more than three. three. You're overwhelming the palate at that point? I think three is a good amount. You know, okay. like you can, you can find great um, store-bought cheeses now from, right. from grocery stores. But I like this. Everybody does this, Curtis. So three cheeses, and you like to mix it with the soft... I right, like that. A soft, a soft, you know, like you want one that's a little more mild, one that's sort of in the middle, and then one that's a little stronger. So mm -hmm. the best way to figure that out is go and speak to the person you're buying it for. And this is easy. We can make this. You can make it. We got Looking the juices, the steaming. This is great. And you get a little charcuterie going. Right. I want to take a field trip with Curtis. Come. Who doesn't want to right. go with Curtis? Raise oh, your yeah. glasses, everybody. Yeah. Field <laughs> trip with Curtis Stone premieres Saturday <laughs> on American Public Television. Curtis, Woo. tell your wife hello and the baby. Sure Salute, my friend. If you love that video, you're going to love everything on the Access YouTube channel. So hit the subscribe button. You can thank me later. Hit it. Thanks.